Hello everybody, it's the Gaming Dad here and we are continuing a Playtale Innocence. We're going to be doing Chapter 9 in the Shadow of Ramparts. With the macula is gaining around in Hugo's blood, Lucas feels powerless to help the boy. He needs the knowledge found with a rare book stored in the university of the neighbouring town. Melly knows the way and is determined to save her brother from the Inquisition, so offers to take Amicia there. We've actually got about four achievements. One of which we can actually earn anywhere, but I'm going to earn it in this video, and that's for crafting 100 items. And we've got about 5 collectibles altogether. One gift, two curiosity, one herb, and an alchemist cart. If you can please like this video, subscribe to my channel, and hit the bell notification to keep yourself updated. Cheers. And as we can see, we're going to be doing some stealthy missions. The first rule of survival is hidden between the legs. Wouldn't the head be quicker? You're way too soft. Shh. There are the town ramparts. We're actually going to get our first collectible as well, which is a herb, and it is lavender, and we actually don't need Hugo for this. So we're just going to go here and lavender. pick it up. Are you off to a ball or something? Oh, it's my brother. He likes putting them in my hair. Aristocrats. There we go. We also get the achievement herbalist for collecting six what flowers. Is on the bridge? It's the townsfolk. They're being evacuated. Let me guess. The bite's here. Exactly. And where there's the bite, you'll also find... The Inquisition. Aren't you the smart one? No. Did you know him? A thief. I used to work with him. He was gifted. So that's the punishment for stealing. Death. I don't want to find Arthur with that kind of caller. Come on, let's go. Over to you, Matt. I'll open this. Then I'll go take care of Arthur. All right, so where will I find the university? It's the big building at the other end. You can't miss it. Do you think we'll see each other again? I hope so. You owe me. Shit. That means you're not allowed to die. <laughs> I'll do my best. There you go. Go on. Get going. Good luck. You too. The city folk. They know they'll die if they stay here. But you think they'll leave of their own accord? Come on. Get a so move. We've got a few ingredients to, to collect. Thankfully he does not see us. So the first ingredients are over here. We've got a salt here which are filling alcohol and sulfur. Now when we get an opportunity to pick up stuff when we're maxed, we're going to do it and create ingredients. So that'll give us enough ammunition to get the achievement created. So we're just going to try and sprint as much as possible so the video doesn't take too long because this one is going to be a long one. Whoa. Over there. That must be the university. All that light. I don't like this. You'll be regretting saying that because you know what's going to be coming up. It's way off. But you can do this. Here we go. So anyway, we're continuing on. You in there? This is your last warning before we drag you out on your ass. All right, sir. We're just getting our stuff together. Elsa, leave those places and get out some warm clothes. Bloody bourgeois. Also, some enemies can be avoided, like these two guards here, so we're not actually going to kill them, but we're going to go and get two ingredients, we'll get saltpeter and rock, open this, and what do we get? We get some fabric, cord, which are really good, and alcohol. Let's create some devorantis, as we've got the spare ingredients. Now we're going to slowly, or sneakily, get across just in case they hear us. There's also two different types of, like, lanterns the guys have, that one there which we can actually knock out, but we're not going to use it. Or destroy it. But this one here, this guy got, we can't actually destroy. By order of the Grand Inquisitor Vitalis, martial law in the 
in France and the city under the control of the Inquisition. Any people who choose to remain will be arrested and executed. Because I've re been well, I've been replaying it and doing chapters. Once I craft this, this should get me the alchemist achievement. And I'm just going to create some ignifier. There we go. And we'll get ourselves the achievement. Now I'm going to collect the stick here and go back and let this guard go all the way there. Because right now we're not actually going to go towards it until he's got his back to us. Because once we light it, he will, well, if he sees it, magically turn on, he'll come and get us. So let's get the stick lit. Now we can do two ways, we can go straight for that pot in the background and then let him pass. Well actually we can only do one way because there's, guards and, uh, there's rats in the way. So we're going to wait till he gets there and then we're going to sneak behind him. And we're just going to make a beeline for this wall and climb it. Now he's seen us but we're fine. Now we're going to collect the ingredients at the back here. Fabric, which is always great. And some leather. You go and see if you can nick stuff with all these rats around your feet. You want to keep it down a bit? You know what Lord Nicholas does to looters. Ah, the scarlet monkey stuck up warm in the bastion. And everyone else is doing the same as me. So wait until this guy goes away. And then we're going to throw a rock to get this guy to come towards it. And then we're going to follow him so we can actually get past the rats. Come on. Start turning around for us. Because this is the most invaluable time. I need to calm down. Yeah, you do. You also need to move. There we go. So we're going to stick quite close to him. And then we're going to pick up this. Now we're going to get an ignifier and we're going to actually throw it over there for him to turn around. That's not right. I'll go and see. So we can go like so. Now we can also go here and collect saltpeter and alcohol Am I going crazy? to max out our ingredients. So we've actually got a chest over there, so we're going to lit that torch. We're going to go to it later on, well, in the next two minutes or so. We'll go down here, and we've actually got saltpeter and alcohol, so we're going to create more devarantes. And we've got some sulfur, and we may as well create ignifier, because we've got a spare sulfur there. And somehow we can't just drop down, so we've got to use this ladder. Anyway, to the left we're going to have some more ingredients. We've got some cord, which is always great. Saltpeter and sulphur. So, we're going to make some more Devarantis as well. And get the saltpeter. I'm not going to use up too much Malco, because I want to get close to Max at all times. But I don't want to kind of get less and less. Anyway, I forgot to get a stick. So let's collect that. And then we're going to light it here, and we're going to go through the rats to where I lit that torch with my sling. There'll be a chest. And some more sticks. And we're going to open the chest and we'll get some nice ingredients. A tool, leather, alcohol. And get another stick and light it back and repeat by going back through.
Come on rats, go away. And they just disappear. Let's continue on. Nothing down these nooks and crannies. I don't know where I am. Do these things still alive? Stay put and keep quiet! What's going on? No! He is my husband! He was your husband! It's all over for him now, so get lost! Not by myself! I can't leave without him! Shut up! You heard of martial law? Wanna die before he does? Oh my right, goodness! I'm contagious! Get out of here! Listen to him! Fuck off! Now! Oh Lord! Lord! Ready them for mature. I'm tired of your bullshit! I didn't sign up for this. Right, he's gonna go away, so we're gonna continue on. And inside here, oh, we've got a pleasant God. view of this gentleman. Now, there's a chest in the background there, there's actually an ingredient that we need to get. But we need to make sure this guy dies close. So the rats can eat him. Then we can get past and open the chest. Timing is key. And luckily enough I killed him so we can actually mount that. Anyway, there's leather and there's our curiosity, God. which is a sheepskin. Anyway, we can't actually use that. We're going to run back over. We've got some alcohol and we've got some rocks. So we're going to create one of each. Because we can. Because we're maxed out again. Anyway, we're going to continue on up the stairs and we're going to have two of the lovely ingredients, fabrics. Because these ones are rare. Or than the other two. Oh, when will it stop? That's lovely. People are making out. They've all been executed. You shouldn't even be there. Why? Why did you do that? You're the good boy. No son is here because he's obeyed orders. He was scared and ran off. Locked. So the reason I'm shooting them is because that's going to help us proceed later on. Make sure we get some rocks as well. Right, we're okay to go. So this is going to be not for the squeamish, but inside we're going to get another ingredient if we want. Right, stay and calm. We're not going to get it because we're maxed Think out. Think of Hugo. This is all for him. So we've got a guard up here who we're going to take out, not for an expensive meal. And get his helm weapon up. And then go for a headshot. And there's nothing exciting over there, but we need to get the Ignifier and light up that torch. We can climb over and climb up and collect some cord rocks. It's all here if we wanted. We're actually going to leave it there now. Did he drop anything? Nope. Tight fisted. And a pot. We're going to collect the stick though, because it's going to get us a little side chest. But we can continue like normal because the guards we've, well, the guys we were hanging, we attacked them so they went down. I attacked the chains and it came down. Anyway, we're going to light the stick here and we're going to make a beeline for the back here. Remember the scriptures. And we're going to light this torch to open the chest because if not, the rats will kill us. Inside this chest, we're going to get some alcohol, sulfur, and fabric. Let's create more Ignifiers, we're maxed out, and we'll pick up a stick, and light it again just to get back. Now, we could easy enough leave this guy, but we're going to just take him up now. Because he blocks the way that we need to go. Anyway, we also need to use the Ignifier to move the rats out of the way to continue on. 
Now it does look like there's four rats going about, but they won't harm us. I don't know what the kind of maximum or minimum amount it is for them to do damage to us, but I'm not going to find out. Anyway, let's collect some rocks. We're maxed out on pots, usual. And we're going to continue like so. I made it. Oh, but I'll never forget this smell. So off the cart, we've got some alcohol and sulphur, which we can create, but I'm actually going to collect, create some Devorantis because we're maxed out on lightning fires. We'll actually be not getting the two that we do for crafting. See? So we're going to wait until Keep we upgrade going. it. The cemetery. It's on the way. I really don't want to go through it. The Inquisition wants to put it in. I'm going to turn it over here. here. <laughs> Clever. The Grand Inquisitor doesn't do things by halves. You were very close to actually getting bitten. And we're not actually needing anything over there. Sometimes it looks like we're sliding or moving side to side when I'm not even actually controlling it. So hopefully we'll never actually die from that. Anyway, inside here, we've got a chest, we've got a tool, more sulphur, leather, rocks. Now it looks like everything. We can upgrade nothing apart from the pouch, but I'm not going to do it yet. I'm either saving for the ammunition bag or the pocket. But we'll find it later on what we're getting. Coins at least. Oh, no! Must have something. Something worthwhile. Everyone's gonna be the. What? Hey! So, yeah, that happened. I moved away in the rats slowly and surely. We're eating them. So, you can get an item of sulfur there if you really want to. And on the right hand side, we've got some saltpeter, which we're going to create because there's an alcohol there we can use up. Like so. Now we're going to turn this torch, beam, whatever you want to call it, to this door. Just to move any of them on the other side away. A window. Perfect. I need to move these lovely rats by the door here out of the way as well. So we can get out of the window. Let's get out of here. Magister, the Episanguis. Ah, let's see. Perfect. If I may be so bold, we know it comes from those rats, but what's it for? Odorous. Oh. Oh. That is just one of the effects of the Episanguis, when we mix it with sulfur. But that's not what we are interested in. But, so why don't we let our units use it, eh? It could... It is too precious! Each Episanguis crystal must be kept for our project, particularly as in this form. It has been the source of some, how should I say, regrettable accidents. Deliver it to the Bastion. That is enough for today. Regrettable accidents? Imagine you spill some on your feet. You'd have to do your patrol on your ass. <laughs> <laughs> so that's getting us introduced to our next throwable. Which we'll be getting very shortly. Happy sanguis. I need to see this. They're gone. Come on, it's just a cemetery. And I've got some rocks here. And some leather. And alcohol. What are you so excited about? Oh. Because there's alcohol there, we're going to create some magnifiers. And jump down. And collect. So this is these. Right. Epicenter. 
nice and soft. We have to crush them up together. Now, you just have to try it out. Lucas, this one's for you. So the odorous, or whatever it's called, attracts rats from the surrounding area. So obviously you can't use it if there's no rats visible. But as you can see, there's also a time limit. It's working. I think it's six seconds. This will save my life. I need to find more. Remember, the effect doesn't last long. Also, we've been able to... Well, we've actually unlocked, sorry, the alchemy stuff. Now, there's no achievements tied to this, so we're going to avoid it unless we've got some spare ingredients. And we're going to try and throw this as far as possible. Just because I like to test my throne abilities. Anyway, we're going to continue like so, and we've got some lovely fabric and sulphur and rocks, which there's no point because we're full there, and we're still not entirely Over there. It full looks on like Saltpeter. Come on, it's not that far. It looks like it's not that far, but there's still some stuff for us to do. Anyway, we need to throw this odorous again, so we can get across to the torch or beam thing and collect I these. Need to find something to hoist myself up. Let's also create more of this. Now you can just move this all the way to the right to move these rats so they're stuck down there and out of the way. I can't. If I can get it down there, I could climb on it. So we're going to make use of our odorous by throwing it down here. Which will take all the rats and move this lantern. Now, the lantern, quickly! All the way to here to trap them. Yes. And we need to collect one more of these. Now we're going to collect this old Peter here. And climb behind this is a lovely collectible. The shield. Getting us another way towards 100%. Open that because we like to open as much gates as possible. And we're going to climb up and push the crate. All right. This pushing Can stuff is not the greatest go? aspect of this game. It's very tedious. And quite weird controls to be honest. Like tank controls. And then we're going to push this down. Like so. See, it moves and it's oh, weird. Oh no. As you can see, all the rats are in the pit. That was very discreet. Right, now just a bit more. And we're going to climb up here. And continue on like so. You see? You're doing it. You're getting there. There's nothing there, but there is stuff here. Rocks, sulphur, and some cord. Now we actually have enough cord to do some crafting. So we're going to create the ammunition bag. Holds up to 10 ammunition of each type. A new fastener eliminates any remaining unused space in the ammunition bag. So it's using a lot of alcohol, but <laughs> they should make things we'll a get that easier. back. Alcohol is quite an easy ingredient to come across. Anyway, we're continuing on like so. I'm going to see some My lovely what happened here? footage here. Very cheery footage. Oh, closer. Your book better really exist, Lucas. Oh Lord, the sick. They've slaughtered them. The rats. They've, they've unleashed the rats. Help me. I can't. I'm sorry. I can't believe it. They used the rats against the sick. Dirty little beasts. What have you got to say that's so important? Odorous. I could try. <laughs> They'll give you a reason to yell once you're in the bastion. You'll see. So let's just make him away. So Rinan actually go that way. That noise. Better go see what it was. Yeah, she go and see what it was. And that'll be sufficient enough. Collect a pot and collect some alcohol. It worked. 
I need to get past them here. These are some ingredients down here. We've got some fabric, some cord and tool. And that's all. This is quite an imp important chest to get as the ingredients are quite good and harder to come by. Why? Because it's too late for you. Ah. Call it mercy. But don't worry. Yeah. All the others will soon be saved. Hey! Stop chucking them in the water. They'll all end up on the other side. We can't patrol there anymore because it's sucks. Well, you're lucky you can still smell something. Huh? What's all that noise? It's your death, basically. Because now you're there. <laughs> you're gonna get eaten. And we're getting some our ingredients back. And some cord, leather, and more of that lovely ingredient we have. Now, can we use anything? Nah, we're quite low on alcohol, so let's try and avoid. We've got enough ingredients anyway. The Episanguis cages. This is not just an evacuation. We're all going to get ill hanging around here. Passing it on from one signal. Right, we're coming to you later on. We're going to go and get the alchemist cart. There'll be no one left. Shut the fuck up! Stop crying! I don't want to hear So we need to use the Luminasa. Sounds something like Harry Potter. Clear the way. And here's the alchemist cart. The second one of the game. Sulfur, leather, sulfur, sulfur, alcohol, and some rocks. And no anything else to upgrade. But we have got two of these lovely ingredients. So, we're going to use the rock here to distract this guy. That noise. I think it came from over there. Yeah. And we're going to move this out of the way. Nothing to report. And we're going to pick up this. And wait for him to climb. Kill them rats. Now while well, they're demolishing them, we're going to pick up some leather. Some f more leather. Unfortunately we can't pick up that because we're full. And we're going to use this beacon and turn it to the left to push these rats back away. And see if he's dropped anything for us. Which we're already full on anyway. Thanks man. Continue on, and we're going to have a lovely scene of this poor dying gentleman. Inside, to tell me what to do. I, Pick up all I, I these. Don't know. What? Oh. oh no, don't drink that. Yeah, don't drink that, pal. Oh, this is a nightmare. Yeah, it's too late. Come on, be brave. The university must be close. We're coming up to the large bit of the level and near the end Vitalis, we're just the butcher who killed my it. father works for you his blood is on your hands too so we're going to wait we've got one two three four five guards we're waiting until these two are in the middle now release the rats that's them taking out Let's just run down here and get the rocks. Nope, that did not actually distract him. We'll come back to him. To the left here we're going to have more ingredients that we can't use. And we're going to make use of this Devorantes. Pick 
by taking him out. Got some alcohol, some rocks. And we can also replenish our pot, but we've got to be quick because the rats are going to hold in on us. Stay here, so they go away. I made many mistakes there where I've let them come towards me, and they have it me alive. Anyway, he's not actually dropped anything exciting. And we've got another guard here. Which we're going to do the exact same process of elimination. What was that? Yep, that sometimes happens. Unfortunately, it happens more often than not. Because I forget to take into the time or well, the distance of the actual throw. And he's not dropped anything exciting. The last guy here. There's multiple ways to kill him. We're not going to waste our pot. We're just going to go the old fashioned way of. <laughs> Killing him like normal. Because we've got a few ingredients over here. And he's not dropped anything exciting. We've got some cord, leather, and fabric. And nothing exciting over there. Getting close to the end of this chapter. And it's not bad for time. It's not the longest video. Yes, it's the shortest. Now we need to go in there. Shit. I really thought I was going what to on earth are they doing here? Simmer down. A bit we need to take these guys out as soon as we. possible. That doesn't give them the right to act like assholes. Anyway. Make quick work of those guys. He's waving at us. You alright, mate? Some rocks and nothing else. And this is the last collectible of this chapter. Huh, a a chessboard. Chess Lucas might like it. Yeah. So there's uh, two achievements left and that's for finishing and also getting in the hard way. We could go the easy way and go in that way or whatever other way, I've never actually tried. But to get in the hard way achievement, we need to go this way. So we need to wait until that guard looks away and take him out. So let's run away from this guy, because he is going to be quite slow. Which will give us enough opportunity to get some space between them. And he's got his back to us. And he's going to go and check his pal's bodies over there. But we killed him before... He actually got them anyway. And he's not dropped anything exciting. And now let's see. Anyway, we're going to open this door. We're going to finish the chapter and get the achievements. Thank you so much for watching. Please like this video, subscribe to my channel and hit the bell notification to keep yourself updated. See ya!